transponder. You made it in time. As you wake, the tadpole squirms in your skull. Other than the infection, you're more or less intact. A miracle, given everything you've been through. But it'll all be for nothing if you don't find help soon. The tadpole is a death sentence, and the clock is ticking. You need a cure. the ship. I remember falling. Then nothing. You might want to reconsider calling her a friend. Looks like she ran off without us. You're more concerned for her than she is for you, clearly. We need to take care of ourselves. First things first. We need supplies, shelter, and most of all, a healer. We might have escaped, but we still have these little monsters in our heads. No, I don't recognize this place. But anything's an improvement on where we just came from. We need each other, and we both know what's at stake. Can't think of better company. One thing, just before we go. I wanted to thank you again for freeing me. It would have been all too easy for you to run right past my pod, but you didn't. I'll remember that. 
Lead the way. Stop me yet. What's in here? in here. Should mind my step. Fresh water. There must be a settlement somewhere nearby. Something the matter. We haven't gone all that far yet. What are you referring to exactly? I suppose we'd go our separate ways. Not a slight on your company, of course. Perhaps, perhaps not. If we do survive, we'll have separate lives to return to. I need to get to Baldur's Gate. There's someone waiting for me there. Someone I have to reach. As soon as possible. Thank you. And you're right. It's a delicate matter. Not something for light conversation. Must I? Thinking about it won't help. We know what to do, so let's do it. Find a way to rid ourselves of these things. We've no solid leads right now, though. We'd best get hunting. If you discover anything that might help us, I'm all ears. strike could be lethal.
survival isn't such a distant prospect. I've got one of those brain things cornered. There, in the grass. You can kill it, can't you? Like you killed the others? There. Can you see it? Keep that darling neck of yours. And you, keep your distance. No need for this to get messy. I need her alive. Stow that blade or I'll show you just how messy things can get. <laughs> promises, promises. But I have other business, I'm afraid. Now, I saw you on the ship, didn't I? Nod. to hold the memory, but it fades to the worm. The light. The fear. <laughs> what was that? What's going on?
The worm. Of course. That explains things somewhat. And to think, I was ready to decorate the ground with your innards. <laughs> Apologies. <laughs> A kindred spirit. My name's Astarian. I was in Baldur's Gate when those beasts snatched me. Is that so? We clearly move in different circles. So, do you know anything about these worms? No. Of that much we can be certain. These worms are already affecting me. I can feel it. Now, what to do about it? You know, I was ready to go this alone, but maybe sticking with the herd isn't such a bad idea. And you seem like a useful person to know. All right, I accept. Lead on. Keep a blade close. Approach the dying monster. This is the thing that abducted you. You could end its life here and now, if only you didn't feel compassion. Compassion? The poor creature is on the brink of death, but there's still time. You'd give your life to save it, to nurse it back to health. But then the feeling slips. The creature's mind seems to focus elsewhere. The monster lies exhausted, defeated. Its eyes, wet orange pearls, radiate malice. Approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. 
It looks slightly dangerous. Waterdeep. Apologies. I'm usually better at this. A bit shocked, but friend, it's a relief and a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Say, but I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking. You were on the North Lloyd as well. And I can only assume you too were on the receiving end of a rather unwelcome insertion in the ocular region. No use sugarcoating it, is there? The insertee we speak of, this parasite, are you aware that after a period of excruciating gestation, it will turn us into mind flayers? It's a process known as ceramorphosis, and let me assure you, it is to be avoided. You don't happen to be a cleric by any chance, do you? A doctor? Surgeon? Uncannily adroit with a knitting needle? You seem to know enough about our condition to realize it's beyond most clerics' skills. Most, no doubt. But I find myself hoping to be in the presence of the few. You don't happen to be one of them. And it looks like we're both starved for answers. We're most certainly going to need a healer. And soon, too. How about we lend each other a helping hand once more and look for a healer together? Most excellent! Parasite shared is a parasite halved. Or something to that effect. Oh, but before you think you're about to embark on a journey with most ill-mannered a man, thank you for pulling me out of that stone. It was an act of foresighted kindness, I assure you. I have the feeling ample opportunities will present themselves for me to return the favor. Let me work my magic. breathing, despite everything. These boots have seen everything. Safe. 
have to keep going. You're both twice as tall as me, but I'm half the bloody backbone! But we don't know what that thing even is. And what about the crypt? I'm telling you, it's a ship. And the crypt can wait. Mari and Barton have been trying to break in for days. Now we... Stop! Got ourselves competition already. That's our ship. Well, uh, in that case, come on, you lot. No point in getting killed. Second worm gets the cheese and all. Um, second mouse gets the cheese, no? Nobody's getting any damn cheese! Now move it! You're more cunning than you look. I thought we had a fight on our hands. There's something underneath here. something underneath here. I've got a long road ahead. Never a dull moment. At the ready. Well, do you give a book? Everything all right out there? Yeah. Well, I've always were a bit soft. But I've got plenty of friends who ain't soft. Come in here and you can meet them. Keep your distance, darling. How oh, for a skeleton key?